Francois Kricker was born in 1913. He was the fourth son to a distinguished Afrikaans family in South Africa. His eldest brother, Ace Kricker, was also a famous poet and writer. While Kricker did not adhere to any particular stylistic movement, the influence of European and South African Impressionism, Post-Impressionism and Expressionism can be seen throughout his work. The influence of Gauguin is perhaps upmost in the work such as Study of Leucodendrons and even Matisse in the lot Reclining Nude. In 1967, Kricker and his wife Sylvia settled in Montego for a simpler lifestyle away from the hubbub of the city. This suited the artist as he wanted the privacy and peace to paint. The couple's garden and the vegetable patch became a new passion and provided key inspiration for his later works. This work in particular depicts the artist's wife reading in their luscious garden, with a view of the artist's studio to the side. Kricker lived out his final years in his beloved home and died in 1994. During his lifetime, he rarely exhibited his works and they were seldom seen by the public. But after his death, the family converted his home into a gallery with his works on permanent display. Kricker's life and work spanned a critical time in South African art when the parochial local art scene shifted and aligned itself more closely with international trends. Kricker's work is admired amongst the South African masters and these are three fine examples that show the artist's immense talent and care for painting.